So I, I saw a that I was really interested in doing the financial modeling uh, work. I found it much more rewarding than trying to balance a balance sheet at the end of each month and do the journals um, to to make sure that everything was reconciled and balanced. And so so I I found myself naturally wanting to not do the process of accounting, but to understand the value that accounting could bring to the business. So one of them is is a discipline that has to be done that allows a business to uh, record keep. The value, I was looking for where the value is, and the value of a management accountant meant that I could uh, help articulate the company as to where it was making profits or losses, or where it was overspending or underspending, or why things were different from what the forecast was. I therefore really understood where the forecasting came in and the value of the forecasting and also the the problems of making a forecast incorrectly Mm. and and so predicting the future became okay i really want to be able to do that accurately accurately so forecasting accurately means that you need to be able to build the models that can do that and to cope and to cope with um perhaps unintended consequences that are not always foreseeable um, so most people can f- figure out two moves of a Rubik's Cube, what that might look like. 15 moves might be a little bit different to what you might think it looked like. So having some process where you can accurately forecast many, many multiple things happening at the same time and understanding the impact of all of those, that's, for, that's financial modelling.